So the time has arrived for you to give up on your coffee addiction. Perhaps you want to be 100% carnivore, maybe you have some gut issues you want to address, or autoimmunity issues, low acidity of your stomach, any of this reason is a good one to give up on coffee. But you really love your coffee, especially in the morning, the ritual of making it and then drinking the hot steamy drink. I might have some solutions for you. Welcome back to Big City Mom channel. When I decided to give up coffee, I wasn't convinced that it was the trigger for my autoimmunity or for other gut issues, although I knew I was sensitive to it. There was no way I could go to sleep before 3 a.m. if I had fully caffeinated coffee at 2 p.m. So I knew I had problems breaking down of caffeine and it would stay in my system for a really long time. So I was drinking weak coffees, usually one to two cups, and if there was another one, it usually was decaffeinated and nothing past 2 p.m. But I gave up coffee because when I got the paleo ketogenic diet, which is a variant of the carnivore diet, uh, the request was to stop with coffee altogether. It didn't matter whether it was without sugar, without cream, just give up coffee, give up tea. And I wanted to be really successful on this diet, so I just quit it. Giving up coffee, easier said than done. I was so addicted, probably more so to this ritual of hugging my cup of coffee first thing in the morning and sipping on it. And then just planning my day. I absolutely love this ritual. So out of desperation, I was trying to find some substitutes that were carnivore or carnivore-ish that I could drink instead of morning coffee. So my first carnivore substitute for coffee is collagen, raw egg yolk, butter and salt. If you have autoimmunity, severe gut issues, at the very minimum this one should be neutral, but it should be actually helpful because collagen is good for the healthy gut lining also for the joints. Egg yolk has egg yolk lecithin which plays a role in restoring of healthy uh, and robust gut lining and butter for me is all right I don't have any reaction to butter and I was used to putting it into my bulletproof coffee when I was on the ketogenic diet and salt is basically for flavor Another carnivore substitute to your morning coffee could be colostrum, egg yolk, beef gelatin and butter. Now at the very minimum, all of these ingredients will be neutral to your gut but very likely are going to actually improve it. So beef gelatin plays the role in restoring of healthy gut lining and so is colostrum. They actually did the studies showing that supplementation with colostrum improved the health of the gut lining. My experience with colostrum is that it was really effective in improving all of my allergies. I would say my allergies improved by about 80% when I started supplementing with colostrum. Now it is a dairy derived molecule, so um, you have to see how sensitive you are. Some people are so sensitive to dairy that it doesn't matter how isolated the molecule is, it will still trigger autoimmune response. So you have to see for yourself if this is something appropriate for you.
All right, so what you are getting here is a nice, warm, creamy drink. Excellent replacement for your morning coffee. It really tastes similarly to latte, but what is more important, it is 100% carnivore. And if you have autoimmunity, not very likely will it give you any uh, flare-ups. Yeah, it tastes similar to latte or bulletproof coffee without the bitterness of coffee. If you are tackling your coffee addiction but um, not ready to stop with sugar yet, or perhaps it isn't even advisable to try to quit sugar and coffee at the same time, this would be a quite a process and I'm guessing terrible torture. You can uh, add some honey into your drink if you really want it to be sweetened and it will have this salty, sweet flavor and again, 100% carnivore. And so if you want to reintroduce some plants back to your diet or maybe you just want to go carnivore-ish, but you don't want to drink coffee again, you can use chicory root. I find that chicory root is one of the best replacements for coffee. You brew it very similarly to coffee. It has a similar look and flavor, except that it doesn't leave that acidic aftertaste. You can pour it into your carnivore uh, ingredients instead of uh, water, blend it up, and you will have a delicious latte you will definitely enjoy this drink. really delicious. It is like a proper latte but without the acidity of coffee. And if you don't want to bother with blending but want something hot and steamy first thing in the morning that isn't hot water only, you can uh, combine some cow colostrum and some beef gelatin and make that into your morning drink. Vanilla is optional. If you are at the beginning of your journey recovering from autoimmunity, you might want to skip this one. But as a maintenance, no problem. <laughs> All right, so these are my carnival substitutes for coffee. What I intended to accomplish here is to find animal-based ingredients that I can blend up into a latte-like drink that I could drink first thing in the morning instead of my coffee and make it into the same ritual I was used to with my morning coffee. Now, at the very minimum, I wanted them to be neutral to my leaky gut, but maybe they could even help me. There are a number of studies done about colostrum, uh, beef gelatin, collagen, and egg yolk playing a role in restoring of healthy gut, and I will link them in the description box. And that's how I ended up coming up with a carnivore substitute for coffee. All right, this will do it for carnivore substitutes for coffee. Give them a try, let me know how it goes for you. And if you haven't yet, subscribe, hit that notification bell, comment down below, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.